Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is Simon and welcome to another episode of The Clone Wars. Uh, we're getting quite late now. Um, I think, where were we up to this episode? We're on episode 17. That's crazy. It feels like we've only just started this season and it's been a really good season. Bar the first, you know, few episodes. Uh, it has been really, really good and I've enjoyed it a lot. Probably enjoyed it the most out of any other season. Um, this particular arc itself is pretty good, where we've seen Obi-Wan disguise himself as his own assassin to try and discover a plot to kidnap Chancellor Palpatine. Um, Anakin at first thought Obi-Wan was dead, as we saw in the last episode, he now knows he's not. So it's going to be interesting to see where it goes. So, yeah, let's jump into the episode. Count Dooku, I apologize for my delay. <laughs> Your careless delay oh. could have ruined my plan, Ival. I see Cad Bane is with you. Who is the other one? This is Reiko Hardin. When Bane's escape plan failed, we only succeeded thanks to Hardin. I thought he might be useful for the tournament. Enough uh -oh. small talk. I want my money. That makes two of us. You shall have it, and perhaps much more. Both of you. If you would like to enter our friendly little contest. I'm in, if he's in. You already owe me for one job, Dooku. Anything else would cost you triple. I assure you that if you survive the challenge, the reward will be well worth it. <laughs> I would have thought Dooku could sense him. All the contestants we need. Prepare the tournament. Yes, my lord. So, what kind of friendly little contest do you think the count got planned? I'd be surprised if we all survive. Nice hat. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> Where did you get it? Oh. Well, he's got his old hat back. What are you looking at? It's a nice hat. Oh, it's not his old hat. It's Welcome hat. to Sereno. I thought it was his old hat first. You have been invited here because you are the best bounty hunters in the galaxy. Kira Swan. Two time winner of the Obsidian Sphere. Durol, known simply as Ooh, three eyes. the Exterminator. Six Tat, the Outland's Butcher. Embo, your bounty tallies were second only to one last season. Cad Bane, who needs no introduction. Draco Hardin, the marksman of Concord Dawn. Jacoli, known for never bringing Dawn. anyone back alive. Onka. I right, that name from Rebels. A legendary team. This challenge may prove difficult for you alone. Quasi, oh. your acrobatics once earned you praise from Chancellor Valorum. Sinrich, inventor of the holographic disguise matrix. And finally, Mantu. Your people were once a peaceful race. How far they have fallen. In a few <laughs> moments, all 11 of you will enter what we call the box. Why is the question? Some of you will not make it out alive. For those who do, we are looking for the five most skilled among you. Any additional survivors will be eliminated to preserve the integrity of the job that awaits you. Place your weapons here. For those we choose, you will of course be paid most handsomely. But more than that, you will be a part of an operation remembered as a turning point in the Clone Wars. And when we succeed, we will bring the Republic to its pitiful knees. Listen up. The box was designed by me, Moralo Eva, to simulate certain situations that might happen on the job. Go now. Enter the box. Mm. If you have the courage. 
so many Hunger Game type episodes where it's tournaments or competitions or fights to the death or hunts. Before we begin our first challenge, let me say there is only one rule inside the box. There are no rules. That's not a rule. The point of my thread is to escape and quickly. Because only the survivors will advance to the next challenge. Dioxus, breathe it, and you're dead. Mmm. Everyone knows all about that. Every man for himself. Ah, I see. Kind of makes the rest of them looking competent. There's a hole in the floor which gets you below the gas line. Jump down the hole and follow the tunnel. What if he's wrong? You got a better idea. Not all of them are going to make it. Lightsabers. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Impressive. I sense something different about that one. Tell me what you know about this Rako Hardeen. He killed the Jedi Obi-Wan Kenobi, but only with a sniper rifle. Obi-Wan Kenobi. Mm, he's on to him straight away. It's like Obi Wan and Cad Bane are best friends. Think he may be the best one to lead this operation. 
Ardeen is crafty, I will grant you. But let's see what happens when he is not the key to their survival. To reach your final challenge, you must pass through my ray shield. Mm. The switch to turn it off is on the other side. The syringe on the platform contains a highly electrolytic serum that will allow you to pass through the shield. However, it is toxic to all but one of you. <laughs> Who? So it would seem. Mm, interesting. So that wasn't the one. I'll put you in charge. Does anyone know what this gas bag is saying? I do. He can get us out of this. He's a par one. His blood can take the electrolytic serum. In Are you certain? 50 50. <laughs> Depends on the blood type of the par one. Great. Either way, they're dead. He can float. Uh oh. Hurry up. Oh. Did he die or? No. He's about to. Is he going to play on Obi Wan's hesitations? The final challenge has arrived. Unfortunately, no. Wow. We are going to test your sniper skills. Hit the target. The back boys. I show you how it's done. <laughs> I'm assuming if you miss, you get burned to a crisp. Is Obi Wan actually that good a shot though? He's good with a lightsaber. Uh -oh. This is not the first time you saved everybody's skin, Hardeen. Five more hits? Let's see how good you really are. Hmm, if he really doesn't like him, why doesn't he just kill him? Let's 
Get up. <laughs> oh, what a shame. Out of charges. It's also important as a bounty hunter to be lucky. And your luck just ran out. Oh. Oh, Cad Bane saved him. How dare you defy Morallo Ival? If you're gonna kill him, do it like a man. You heard him, Ival. Show us what you are really made of. Oh, this is interesting now. Oh, come on. Going crazy. Finish him, Arky. Very disappointing. I just want to do my job and get my money. It is unfortunate that your leadership skills are so lacking. Nevertheless, congratulations on surviving the box. Tomorrow you will kidnap Chancellor Palpatine at the festival on Naboo. Mm. The leader of the Republic as our hostage. We will demand the release of all separatist prisoners. If our demand is not met, the Chancellor will be executed. Either way, you will help reshape the galaxy. Once you are all aboard the transport, Ival will walk you through his plan. However, the operation on Naboo will be rotten by... Captain. <laughs> all of you were forbidden now. Well, yeah, some of them are definitely not going to be happy with that. Um, but, no, a very intriguing episode. Another kind of... Um, almost Hunger Games-esque type uh, survive you know survive the challenges type thing um, so it's fairly interesting it'll be interesting to see how this goes from here um, I'm assuming we're going to get the next episode will be the actual plot to kidnap him and like I say I wonder if this is the lead into the beginning of episode 3 it'd be pretty cool if it was but um, yeah anyway guys I enjoyed that I hope you enjoyed it if you did let me know in the comments and I'll see you for the next episode